guys, and welcome to another episode of Among the Stars Celebrity Proofing Reviews. So today, I figured we'd do kind of a, like a different type of video, do kind of like a first impressions with you guys, and I may have found a dupe for my Holy Grail fragrance. As you guys may know, Menagerie Exotic is like my hands down Holy Grail fragrance. I talk about this fragrance so much on my channel. If you've been following me for any length of time, you know I talk about this fragrance a lot. And I've already gone through a full bottle plus this much, and that's just because I've stopped making like I've stopped wearing it um just because I don't want to like hate this fragrance so I wanted to do a little bit of a different type of video and ignore the fact that we have deodorant just chilling in the back of this video um and I figured I think I might have found a dupe and I wanted to do kind of a first impressions with you guys and kind of go through it just because I'm excited and this could be like the dupe of dupes um so if you don't know this it is bergamot orange squeeze and mango middle notes are lavender tiger lily and dewy petals with basins of cedarwood and musk um it's one of my all-time favorite fragrances it's super clean super crisp um it's fruity but also slightly floral slightly musky it's just an all-around great great fragrance and i was looking at notes online of a certain fragrance and I'm just going to read the notes off without showing you guys what the fragrance is. Passion fruit, mandarin, and orange zest. Mandarin and orange zest. Yes, okay, so there's mandarin and then orange zest, so that's very interesting. Um, middle notes are mango, juicy papaya, and tiger lily. With base notes of cedarwood, or sandalwood, sorry. Um, musk, and coconut milk. So... If you guys have also been following me for any amount of time, you know that I'm not a big fan of coconut. Um, so this could ruin this fragrance for me, or it could not. So there's a lot of, there's orange, which there's orange squeeze in um, Menagerie Exotic. There's mandarin, but there's bergamot in, exotic, in, in Menagerie Exotic, if I can even speak. Um, but they both have orange. There's mango in the heart. There's tiger lily. There's tiger lily in Menagerie Exotic. There's musk and magnetic exotic. So this just has papaya. Um, it doesn't have the lavender note in there, I don't believe. Um, no lavender, but it does have sandalwood and coconut milk in my head. It's just, I'm so sorry, guys. But anyway, so let's see if this is anything like magnetic exotic. And what is this fragrance? It is Eau de Juice Good Energy by Cosmopolitan. So I saw this on Alta's website, saw the notes, and was like, hmm, this could be a dupe for Menagerie Exotic. And I didn't want to smell it before I, sh like, got it, so I completely, like, kept it sealed for you guys. Um, just because I want to see if this is a dupe for Exotic. But also, I kind of wanted one of these fragrances, just because of the bottles are freaking adorable. Um... If I can ever get it out of the plastic, we actually get somewhere in life. I also realize I don't have a tester card. That plastic did not want to come off the front of that. So, the bottle looks like this. And let's see if my camera will focus. There we go. Um, and then it's got like a little pumper on the back. And then it like sprays out the front. So, let's see... If this is anything like exotic. Okay. It's got a really nice spritzer too. Ooh. Okay. We're close. This is like probably the closest I've come. But this also reminds me of something else. I can't quite put my nose on it. But this is a lot more orangey, obviously, than Exotic is. Um, exotic is definitely a little bit more heavy on the mango. The coconut milk is definitely making this way creamier than this is. This is a lot more crisp, and this has got some coconut milk that really makes it milky. This reminds me of something hardcore, though. I've smelled this. Whatever this is, I've smelled, and I can't quite quite put my nose on it, but it's definitely, it's not bad. I actually really, really like this. It does have that exotic 
vibe. Like, yeah, there is that kind of, that similarity. There is that exotic vibe. But this definitely reminds me of something. It's a lot more similar to something else. And I can't figure out what it is. But it is very similar to something else. So this is um, an Eau de Parfum, which so is Menagerie Exotic. This is 1.7 Bloomin' Ounces. Um, this was $55 at Ulta. I don't know if it's going to be any cheaper or if it's going to go to like discount places or whatever. But that's just happened where I picked it up and it's brand, brand new. So there you guys go. I hope you guys enjoy this kind of like first impression video. I want to figure out what this is. This reminds me of something. I don't know what it is. But I'm going to figure it out. So, as always, guys, thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Twitter, 8 Perfume, and Instagram, Among the Stars Perfume. The link's in the description below. As always, guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.